Six months ago, our sister died. We, like, haven't been the same since. Season four of Charmed kicks off six months after Macy's death. And the Charmed Ones and Harry are all coping with it in various ways. Man and Maggie, they're a complete mess. The loss of Macy has changed Mel and Maggie's relationship, and there's definitely a rift there. This isn't working. Believe me. I know. Yeah, I don't think she's really full on dealing with like the emotional part of it because I feel like that is too much for her. So she is drinking and having sex and dating. <laughs> Maggie and Jordan have these vigilante nights. <laughs> like a Batman and robin it out there against rogue demons. And it's a way for Maggie to get out her anger and her grief. Whether it's healthy or not is up for debate. Harry certainly is in a dark place. The death of Macy has hit him really hard. For everyone's sake, they need to find the third charm. It's you. Joining the series has been amazing. I feel super lucky. My character is, is burst of fresh energy. You know, she's like fun and exciting and like messy. She adds a really new um, energy to the show and I think people will really enjoy her. I've been having these dreams. People that I've never met in places I've never been, I think I'm going crazy. She has had a hard life. Life's too short. She's been through cancer and like being left at a fire station and she's channeled that into her artwork. We think you might be one of the most important witches alive. It doesn't make sense. You might be the third charm. <laughs> this random person seemingly unconnected to either of you and she's the one who's supposed to replace Macy. It's just been fantastic for us as characters and for the show. This life of yours with a threat around every corner, I don't want it. It feels good. It feels good. It's, we're, we're like family. Wait, we need to talk. <laughs>